Is it the spot where we enter the field? We're close. If we enter through a tunnel over there, inside a volcano, it's an ancient lava tube that brings us through the radiation barrier. How much radiation are we talking? I hate to admit it, but forgot my lead line underwear. It's minor. Nothing to worry about. Is it? Minor? The field is not a safe place, I think you know that already, but you sought this pilgrimage because you have heard rumors of what is inside the field, and because you enlightened citizen know the way. Yes, before we go, you should know this is the last chance to turn back. The path back to town is still straight. Once we enter the field, it will not be straight any longer, and if you become lost without me, that will spell your end. What's that? Is that a drone? Yup, bunch of iron vultures. They patrol the perimeter. It's thousands of miles long. The government guarding their secret facility? The field is no government facility. They keep people out because they do not understand it. Mysteries are a liability to, st to them. Think someone is watching us right now on the other end? Only the machines. The machines are always watching, making their own decisions. I hear humans are almost entirely out of the process. It is a shame. It's coming back. Low background steel. Come on. Help me on that end. Why are you doing this? I need it. Come on again. What do you need this for? Again, again. What's your plan here? We only need this to carry it to the top of the hill. I have never found such a large piece before. I knew this journey would be the one. This is what you use to make the radios, isn't it? Are you... are you making antennas? You're the one boosting the signal, aren't you? Why? No. Uh, okay, you know what? You know what? We're done with this. Forget your ego. Take us to the heart of the field. That's your job. That's what we came for. I think this is a you must learn to trust me. All right. You want me to trust you? You said that heart was close. If you're close, then let's go. Cut the stalling. Stop it. Stop it. That's a satellite phone. You're not supposed to have that. coming from you. How many spare Geiger counters did you bring again? Throw it away. You both have made this trip unnecessarily difficult. But we are at the end now. That was different. I brought an instrument because I'm researching, trying to understand the field. What do you have a satellite phone for? This probably comes as a surprise to you, but you're not the only one with a brain. The phone was for running a practical test to see if the heart can be valuable insights. A practical test? You're going to make a business move or sell your stock or something. But you lied to me. You said you wanted to save lives. There's a phenomenon here which could transcend time 
and space and you want to enrich yourself by gaming the stock market? How uncreative, how selfish. Everything is something to be exploited with you Silicon Valley people. You're just as selfish as me. Why did you come out here? How about we strip down your motivations? We're after the same things, success, respect, a place in history. What's the most powerful motivating force again? The evolution of your behavior. Animals, you are bright beings. I have brought many different people here. People with diverse and divergent lives, each fair and contributing in some way to the heart, connecting it more strongly to the rest of the existence. You two may be the last pieces. You may help me fulfill my vision. Vision? What vision? There's a vision? Radiation storm? Yes! Get your blankets. Hi, I'm Maria Elena Rodriguez. I'm 5'2 and I'm from Los Angeles, California. I can work for a non-union film. I'm very outdoorsy. I love hiking, camping, biking. I love nature. And I'm very athletic as well. I play volleyball, table tennis, bowling, squash. I can even play basketball, but I'm not good at it. Um, I do hope that you will choose me for this role and I look forward to working with you.